There's a distance between us It's getting hard to reach out Haven't seen you in seasons But all I hear is your voice I know my limits You can break me down but I'll stay till the finish line And I've been counting minutes for quite some time now Just to see you again And I've been counting days to get away
can hear my micro. There it is. Now I can hear my microphone. Hello, hello, everybody, and welcome to another fantastic night. We have a lot in store for you tonight. We currently have some Valorant going on. The Eagles are taking on Principia College. This is week three of NACE Varsity Plus. Hope you're all having a fantastic Friday. If you want to watch some Super Smash Bros. that is going on on our YouTube right now, at 6 o'clock, the Eagles are taking on Buena Vista University. At 7 o'clock, we'll be taking on Lakeland University. So that's going on over on our YouTube page. Just type in Edgewood College Esports. You will find that on YouTube. We are live right now with those matches. But tonight we have some Valorant first. Right after that, we have some Overwatch. The Eagles will be taking on University of Guam. And then right after that, League of Legends will be taking on Missouri University of Technology and Science. But first map for some Valorant, this is the first one that we have seen on the stream. We have Lotus. Lotus is the newest map that was added to Valorant. Very, very excited for this one. Should be a lot of fun. Very, very interesting map here. I'm going to put up our stream overlay. So give us one second. And there we have it. So, the Eagles will be defending first. Here on Lotus, Principia will be attacking. So we are on the top left. Right there. Principia in the red on the top right. right we are going to be rolling with a KJ, an Omen, a Sova, a Raze, and a Breach. Principia will be rocking a Sky, a Breach, an Omen, a KJ, and a Neon. So let's get into this one. Game number one coming at you. Again, best of three, all of these games. So here we go. Sova Dart went out, did not see anybody. Sophia will be making a hard rotation over here to see. Here they come. Oh, Joe's gonna find one. Kobe is going to get the heck off of sight, and he will live. And Spike is going to start its plant. Spike planted. Oh, nice dinks there from the Eagles. Luke finds that Neon. Kobe looking for the trade, isn't able to get it, though. Oh, nice job there. The Eagles retaking sight right here. We do have an eye on Neon. Last player standing. 1v1. Uh. Abu looking for it. He will find the kill. I don't know if he's going to be able to get back up to the spike, though, in time. Concentrate, Silva. I don't think he has it. He does uh. not. So first round, even though the Eagles got all the kills, we'll go over to Principia. Good try on that retake. That Neon just playing the time perfectly. So here we go. Round number two coming at you. So the Eagles will be splitting here. They have two on C, one on B, and two on A. Claw through them. Looks like Principia might choose to go through... Mid here. Forever. You're gonna hear a few. First person will be Keelan. Not able to find the kill there is Joe. Oh, nice trade there from the Eagles. Oh, nice flash there. Keelan's gonna find a few. And there is one left. Last player standing. One more for Luke here. And Luke is going to pick up the kill. Nicely done. The Eagles picking up a round. Making this one one to one. Thrifty. All I need is spare parts. Oh, and Luke is actually going to find himself a Vandal. Very nice. Eagles will go ahead and buy some guns here. And Luke, or I'm sorry, Keelan is actually going to have his ultimate, so that is going to be massive here on Breach. 
Kobe's gonna be soloing over here on C. Keelan's gonna hear him all very, very close. Nice grenade there, it's gonna stop him a little bit. Looks like Principia might be rotating over. Yep, we are gonna get the notification. KJ is gonna know that they have rotated over here by C site. Oh, we are gonna pick up that neon. That is massive. We were able to get her on our alt. Here comes the breach ultimate. Flashes are out. Joe is in. Everybody's blind right now. Oh, two go down for the Eagles. Joe or er, Sova's actually gonna be able to pick up one. Backside is the last one. Last oh, standing. actually there were two left. Luke looking for one. Oh, nice swing there from Principia, and they will pick up the kills. They will take round number three. Eagles do not have a ton of money. Looks like they might choose to save here. Yep, that is what they are going to do. Principia, they will have full loadouts. The Eagles looking to pick up an eco round here. Turn out. Man, this caster has a beautiful voice. <laughs> Goodness, Kane, hi. There goes a grenade. The Eagles are going to move maybe here. Oh, nice dart there. So we are going to know that Principia is around. Who's going to see a few? Bomb buddy out. Well, that's going to kill the bomb buddy. Unideal. Eagles are still waiting here. Joe does only have a shorty here. Very, very careful. He will get the heck out of there. Does get that ultimate point, though. It's pretty massive. I've got your trail. Luke is going to find one. We are going to find another one. Nice. Abu's going to pick up one more. Not able to kill that breach, though. Thirty seconds left. Jacoby is in. One enemy remaining. Last player. Jacoby looking for the kill, and Jacoby is going to get the kill. And I think I just heard the breach alt as well. So Jacoby picking up the clutch kill while the Eagles were on an eco round. That is absolutely massive. Very nicely done. Also, I didn't address this. Is it? It's always a great day to be an Eagle. This is a true statement. There is a three minute delay, so if I get to your comment late, that is why. I apologize. League rules, we gotta we gotta have this delay on. Kobe's gonna lose alarm bot. In by mid. Eagles are gonna have a little bit of company here you on should run. B site. Here comes the KJ's ultimate. Keelan's gonna find a kill though on the lurking neon. That is absolutely massive. He might get some company though. Bot is going to spot one. Nice grenade. Here comes the Silva ult. Oh, he's gonna pick up one. Just barely misses the other though. So Keelan has come back here by C site. That omen, you can see number eight on the bottom, or the top left, bottom left of the map. It's kind of gradually come over. All of Principia just kind of waiting to see what the Eagles do here. They are down two. Joe has come over. Looks like Principia might 30 seconds left. go towards B site. You're going to find one. Joe finds one. He does get the trade here. 
who does have a nice little Spike planted. angle here. One enemy remaining. Joe's gonna find one, and the Eagles are on site. Nice job there. Good Sova Dart finds the KJ. Two were in the smoke for the Eagles. Team shots. Very nice. Very nice. The Eagles do have a nice eco right now. Principia might choose to save here. It looks like they are. They are going to save. They're going to try to get this round. Luke does have alt and Joe has alt, so Joe a little bit more global can get to any site really or anywhere on the map that he wants to with his ultimate. Luke might pull out a big bazooka and go crazy. So Principia might be going fast. They are going to be going fast over here by this C site. Eagles do see this neon. Keelan's trying to be very, very safe. He's going to get the heck out of there. We are going to retake. Spike, planted. Spike goes down. See what the Eagles can do here. So Joe is making his way all the way back. Okay. Joe's gonna find one. The Eagles are on site. Right there. Here comes Luke with his ultimate. Nice kills there. One left to go for the Eagles. See if they can pick it up. Abu is going to find the kill, and the Eagles will defuse. Team Ace. And we see a Team Ace from Hell the Eagles. Yeah. Next drink's on me. Very nicely done. Great retake there. Great use of ults there from Luke. Good job from Keelan there to get the heck off of Seasight and play with his team for the retake. Eagles are going right to switch there. up their setup just a little bit. Time out. Alarm bot out. Keelan will be over here on C site alone. It looks like Principia is doing a split though. Enemy mud. <laughs> So we do see a trade here by A site. We see Principia kind of back off here. They will group up mid. Keelan and Abu will have first contact. Looks like Principia will be starting their ascent here into mid on a B site. Oh, Keelan finds one. Abu looking for another, cannot find it though. Boo did find one, two, V. We do hear the door go. Found them. Alarm bot is triggered. Kobe will play retake. 30 seconds left. Here goes the bomb getting planted right here. Spike planted. Luke is holding this angle. One enemy Does remaining. find the KJ. Nice shots there. Kobe will find the final kill and the Eagles will defuse. Nice job there from Luke getting that pick very, very quickly. We will take that round. Five to two, the total score here on Lotus. And we have KJ Alt. So this is going to be massive for us. We can use this in a retake, or we can use this to stop a fast plant. Time See what out. the Eagles choose to do with it. Keelan will be soloing here on C. The Eagles doing a good job just kind of rotating everybody around, not really still staying too stagnant on sites. Flash is here over by C. Principia making their way over. I've got your trail. Here comes Principia. Keelan will find one. 
And then he'll get the heck out of there. Spike planted. See if we want to use this. Ultimate coming in from Keelan. Not able to find the sky. Find one though. Oh, nice wall bang there. Last one to go is that Sky. We do know where she is, though. Keelan holding this angle. Joe's going to hold one as well. Nice job there from the Eagles, and we will find another round. With a great ultimate there from Keelan. Did not invest the KJ ult. So we will have that one for another round. I bet we're going to match another. I bet we're going to match their KJ ult with our KJ ult. That's probably what we're waiting for. Which I think is a good call. So here we go. Make it a little saucy here. Mid. Ahead. Recon bolt gets destroyed, so Boo has an idea. They're gonna be close. Oh, nice job there. We find two. Who's gonna have two people running at him? Spike planted. Nice job there from Luke. Looking for another. Not gonna find it. Joe's gonna find it. It's a 1v1. Cover going out. Joe knows he's behind him. Nice job from Joe. Plays his time. He knew the KJ was the last alive and knew that she was going to have mollies down on the bomb. Shot the molly. KJ had to come back and check the bomb. Good job there from Joe. Good heads up play. Eagles leading this one 7-2. to two. See if Principia, what are they going to switch up? What are they going to do differently? Grenade! Don't know what Joe's trying to do here. It might Shadow is traveling. So the Eagles are going to know that there are a few here. Here comes Principia. It will be on sight. Just staying out of that one. Got the one. Not able to get the sky though. Keelan has a flank going. Principia knows it. Here comes a KJ ult. I don't know if we're going to use it. Yep, there it goes. Nice job there. We find two. We are going to be able to kill the lockdown drone or lockdown as well. And the Eagles, fantastic use of the KJ alt. Keelan able to protect it and happened to find the other KJ and her alt. And we destroy that one as well. And then our KJ alt got the lockdown onto the breach. And we will take that round. After 10 rounds, the Eagles are up 8 to 2. We have an op on the omen. For some reason I smell garlic bread and it really smells good. Now I want garlic bread. Ah! Here we go. Grenade! Boo's gonna be rotating back. Kobe looking for one. He got a little bit of damage off though. Boo is on site in a smoke. Principia has not fully committed to this, though. Joe is still holding this angle, and I am all here for it. Because this omen is about to peak. 
Keelan found one on the backside. I think that Omen saw Joe and he was like, nah fam, I ain't gonna challenge that op. So Principia has rotated. It looks like there might be shading over by BC. We'll see what they want to do. We heard that flash. Hey. Oh my goodness! Keelan looking for another. Not gonna find it. Nice stun there. He is fighting for his life. Not able to find that kill though. So the Eagles will come back together. Spike planted. Spike gets planted. Boo is found. Boo's gonna get taken down. Op shot is gonna miss. He did find the blind. Jacoby found the other kill. Eagles now gonna work together here. Last player standing. Jacoby has this 1v1, needs to push. He's not gonna have the time to do it. Nice clutch there from Pin Principia. Eagles not peeking together. Last round so in they the half. will have the last round in the half here. Eagles looking to go into halftime 9 and 3. We do have a lot of ultimates to work with. We have Omen ult, we have Sova ult, and we have Breach ult. Looks like Principia might be shading over here by A. Grenade. That worked! It didn't get any kills, but it worked! Principia knows there are a few here on A, and here they come. Sova ultimate. Finds a lot of them. Not able to find full kills, though. Ultimate goes in. That's an absolutely massive ultimate. Jacoby finds one. And Keelan finds two. Keelan found a few there. Jacoby's just going to go ahead and wait. Does oh, that that front count is, or that breach is here? And oh, nice shot there from Joe. The Eagles holding that angle well, Switching and we sides. will go into the half nine to three. The Eagles are up. Very nice. Very Good nice. Game. So Lotus, the brand new map. I love that we're playing this, by the way. Such a pretty map. Let's see how the Eagles attack this one. We only need three rounds. Let's see how we do it. Principia needs a bunch. Here we go. We look like we're going to be attacking A here. Does he have lineups? Area. I think we have lineups. We definitely don't have lineups. <laughs> okay, there's the omen. Eagles will be taking here now. Nice flash there on the site. I'm looking for the knee. I'm not going to find her, though. Eagle's still up one person. And they will go ahead and just back out of this. Joe's going to be hanging around, seeing if he can find any exit kills. Cover going out. Eagles might have C sight for left. free. Area. Oh, Joe's gonna find one. That's massive. Oh, nice. We are gonna get bombed down. 
Joe did go down, but we do have three eagles up. All we have to do now is hold some angles. One will go down. Why are we planting a turret, Jacoby? Yeah, I might just stick this. Jacoby gets the headshot. The classic shotgun for the win. Danny, if I come on March 6th with like pizza and garlic bread or like a mini party stuff, can you tell Joe you're throwing the party? Sure! I'll take the credit. I'll love to take the credit. Let's do it. Here we go. So we do know that there is a sky around mid. Are you gonna be taking this alt orb? That finds a bunch. Ahead. So looks like the Eagles have actually taken Grenade! back sight here. Keelan will go down. Okay. Sight is clear. Uh. Omen blind is in. Joe's gonna go down. Find the one. Find two. Jacoby will go down. Not seven. able to kill that one. Oh, we don't have any bullets! <laughs> Abu tried to spray, did not have any bullets to do so. That round going over to Principia. Still in game number one, 10 to 4. The Eagles are up. See what we choose to do here. This guy is gonna be dogging. Nice. Nice stun there. Eagles just kinda waiting around, seeing what they can see. Principia does have weapons. Keelan has snuck around here. Oh, there's going to be a step. Keelan needs to be very, very careful. He's going to see one of them. Luke might have a massive five head flank here onto this breach. Breach is actually just going to be holding close. He's just kind of waiting to see who's going to peek first. On the Eagles. Do find one. Eagles looking to trade it and they're not able to. We are not on site just yet. Keelan finds one. Not able to get that down. Last player standing. Joe, the last one left alive, but the Neon's gonna take care of him. Principia will defuse the spike. Don't even start that shit here, man. Good defense here from Principia. This map very defensive heavy, so it is tough to get around. Eagles gotta change something up here. Right here. Here we go. Looks like the Eagles are going A. Yeah. Listen, 
omen blind, but didn't do anything. Take flight. Did spot two. Keelan's gonna find one. Off your feet! Breach ultimate coming in. Clearing out. Keelan will find another one. I think he saw that knee and above him. Abu will have the angle. We know exactly where this KJ is. Do not chase her. We have five people to one. All right, at least we team speak. That's what I care about. I don't want to be chasing a 1v1. Very nicely done. So the Eagles pick up that round 11 to 5. Yeah, Kenzie, be fun. I just care about the garlic bread. I can still smell it. Someone above me has to have garlic bread in, or something. They're rocking some garlic bread. The Eagles might be taking C here. Lots of pings all over it, and we are stacked up over here. We're just going to take it by force. I like it. The Eagles have shown a lot of presence over here by C. Let's see if we're just going to... We're just going to go ahead and walk it on out. That drone is going to see the neon. Joe will go back sight on A. This Neon might know about it though. Joe. Gets rocked. Keelan does find that kill. The Eagles are on sight. Not able to find that kill. Thirty seconds left. Thirty seconds to go. Keelan goes down. Do find one. Oh, there are two right there. Do find some trades. Loot the last one in a one v one. One enemy remaining. Does need to plant the spike, but he needs to get to the spike. Ten seconds left. I have the spike. He is not going to be able to plant the spike here. And he will go down. Nice job there from Principia. Really, really good patience. Luke did not have the time to get the spike down. They will pick up that round. 11 to 6. Round 18. Eagles not able to buy Principia. They are going to buy here. They're not going to be too wealthy afterwards, but they are going to buy. Cover going out. Ooh, nice shot there from Keelan. Cover going out. Flash out. And it Nova Drone will see that omen on back sight. Joe's gonna find one. Ooh. Nice job here. The Eagles doing a really, really good job of just peeking together. We are gonna see the spike there. Joe's gonna pick, or I'm sorry, Jacoby's gonna pick up one. Last one is the KJ, and the Eagles have all picked up some weapons. Jacoby staying back. Does have this flank, does have his drone active. Looks like this KJ is going to make a full wrap around to the Eagle's spawn. Looks like this KJ might just play her life. Probably a good call. She does have a gun. Does have a little bit of money as well. Do not peek, Jacoby. Don't do it. The 
Eagles pick up 12. We are looking for one more round. Match Principia point. looking to stay in this one. Match point for the Eagles, and we have Sova Alt, and we also have Raze Alt. They do have Breach Alt. See what the Eagles can do here. Looks like the Eagles are shading over to C site. Just kind of taking some pop shots. Oh, Keelan's going to be on the other side of the map. I didn't even notice this. He's going to get the heck out of here. Oh, he does find two. That is absolutely massive. It looks like the Eagles might have full control of A-Sight. Shadows traveling. So what do we want to do here? Come cuss there. Keelan will be in a really, really good spot. Keelan finds three. Joe's gonna get behind him. He does not find those kills. Off your feet. Nowhere to run. One enemy remaining. Do you find that other one? Luke is just gonna hold this rocket. And it will find the kill. Game number one going over to the Eagles. We will be right back once I show you this screen of the scoreboard as we get into game number two, which will be on Icebox. Stay with us.
Alrighty, folks, we are back. Match, or map number two, not match number two. That would be Overwatch. Map number two is going to be Icebox. The Icy Box. You got to love it. Icebox says, I think it's, was Icebox a beta map? I think Icebox was a beta map. Was it? I think it was. I'm going to say it was. So, the Eagles have already locked in their comp. They will be a defending first, just like they were on Lotus. They will be on the green side, on the left-hand side. Keen will be playing KO. Luke will be playing Jet. Abu will be on Sova. Joe will be on Viper. And Jacoby on Sage. Looks like they have also locked in. We are going to see the exact same comp out of Principia, but they will have a Killjoy instead of a KO. We are already into it. Game number two coming at you. The Eagles looking to put this one away. Icebox was our choice. So let's see what we can do. And what is going to happen is, once this loads up, I will put on our overlay. And then we'll get into it. This go like this, go like that. And I'm going to see that you were out. Oh my goodness. I'm basically a professional here, friends. So again, the Eagles will be defending first on the green side. Only two sites on Icebox, A and B site. Lotus has three. So none of that wonkiness. But let's get into it. Game, or round number one on Icebox. The Eagles will be split. Abu will be on A site. Joe's going to be hanging out in Kitchen with Sage and Luke. Keelan on B site. It looks like Prince of P is just going to march right through mid, though. Eagles have a suspicion. Keelan sees a few. Nice kill there from Jacoby. He will go down, though. He, or Prince of Pia will have full control. Of a sight. Bomb goes down. <laughs> well, nice job there. Joe's gonna find one. Keelan will go down though. Walk him down. We found two. Jonah 1v1. Does know it's a KJ. He might have to push here. This is nothing. We went for the kill. He is not going to be able to win the round, though. Round number one going over to Principia. Hit a nice push there through mid. We got one. The boo was taken off of sight very quickly. And they had full sight control. But round number two, Principia will buy here. So they will have some weapons. They are banking on winning this round. Forcing the Eagles into a buy situation where they will eco. It is ideal for Principia. So Boo will be shooting a dart mid here. Knife, deployed. Knife goes out. Knife is not going to see anybody. The dart will not see anybody A. The Eagles are aware that there was a Viper wall set up on B. Might give him a little bit of information. Keelan is sticking around. I believe that Keelan hears them though. Yep, all of the Eagles will start to rotate. That Viper wall is up. Bomb will get planted. Luke will go down. Nice shots there from the Sova. As he will find three. 2v5 here for the Eagles. Let's see what we can do here. All of Principia is up and they all have weapons. This one might just be... Last player Tough one for the Eagles. We find one. Not able to find any more though. Principia goes up two to nothing here on their attack. The 
The Eagles will have some money to buy some weapons here. So that is quite ideal. Principia, they will eco here. Yep, so they will be set. The Eagles need to win this round, or else they will have to be gunless again. Let's go, Kellen. Chester's PC, watch up. Revealing area. So we're gonna be hanging out here on a site alone. Here comes Principia. Abu is spotted. <laughs> Trying to get that kill on Jet, not able to do it. Jacoby is gonna find the trade. Spike That's actually gonna be Spike. Jacoby finds flank. two. Joe has a flank. One enemy remaining. Joe does still have this massive flank. Keelan found two. Bomb was picked up. A nice job there. The Eagles able to win this round. That is one they definitely needed to get. They will pick up their first one. Two to one. Principia will have enough to buy guns though, so we are going to see another gun round. There. There. So it looks like Principia will once again set up over by A. We might see a little bit of pressure in mid. Walls up. Standing ahead. Does find everybody. The Eagles will be fast to rotate here. Spike will start to get planted. Spike planted. Joe has gone up top. Not this jet. He will find that kill. Elon will get found out. His flank did not work there. No charges left. Joe finds another. Uh, nice kills game. here. Kobe, the last one he around. Will we will see other. a res here from the Sage. Kobe not able to get the kill. Good post plant there from Principia. They will go up three to one here on Icebox. Eagles are not very rich at the <coughs> moment. Keelan will only be working with a frenzy. Suppressing. Viper is going to go over by A, so the Eagles do invest this. Keelan does hear that Sova drone by B. Blue's going to be tucked in a corner. Right here. Spike planted. But Jacoby will go down first. Then suppressed. Keelan will go down next. Blocking sight. Oh, did get that headshot, but he's not able to do much with it. Joe will go down. A boo. One v five for him. He will also go down. Nice job there from Principia. It will go up four to one. The Eagles will be able to buy though. 
do have some money. Do not have Viper Alt anymore, though. Principia might be doing a playthrough mid here. Kobe was peeking it will go down. Principia will start to make their way back over to B now. Might be able to catch out this Sova. Yep, I think Joe will have the information, but it might be too late. Principia is already over on B site. Okay, bomb is going to get planted, but we do pick up the kill. Spike is planted over on B. There, but there is someone behind. Loot finds two. Last player standing. That is a massive flank there from the jet. No one able to clear back Snowman. And that jet will take down three. Another round for Principia. Not very eco friendly here. Not ready yet. Few boys over here. Joe does find one, he does not get out alive though. But he does find one. Planted. Luke trying to get those knives. Maybe not able to make those shots hit. Boo with the marshal not able to get it done. Prince Appeal will go up one to six here. Great attack coming out from them. Eagles need to put together a few rounds here. Mid. Standing ahead. And it will find a few. Joe finding the first pick. That is exactly what we needed to do here. Keelan still hanging out here on B site. Might see Principia just go ahead and back up here. Luke is still on A site. Here comes Principia, they will be making their way. 
who finds a lot of people here not able to get out. Thirty Welcome seconds left. Viper alt goes down. Oh my goodness, Jacoby just found two. Eagles now have Principia in a pickle. One enemy remaining. Oh my goodness! We're just shooting everybody through smokes! Okay, alright, hold on here. I need PC checks on all these players, even though they're playing in our arena. We just shot four people through smokes. <laughs> Very nicely done. The Eagles will pick up around there. That is what you like to see. The Eagles still have a few ultimates to work with. We're going to see a lot of ultimates here from Principia, though. They have... Four. Just use Viper ult, but they have four to work with. Revealing area. Is found out. I don't think he dashed the correct way, but it somehow worked out. You should run. Here comes the ultimate from KJ. to kill it. It's like... Ah. Enemy map. Spike planted. Shot done. Even is behind him. None suppressed. Eagles have to find a bunch here. Even finds one. Standing. Oh, that one was through the wall. Boo here left in a very, very tough situation. Finds one. Not able to find the rest. Principia up 7 to 2. Eagles not able to buy full. They are able to buy some weapons though. It's giving them a little bit of an A. So we are going to be able to put down Viper Alt on A. Find a few there. Kobe might not want to peek this. Deploying drone. Drone is going to go out. Keelan finds one. Chuck Dart. That is quite massive. You will not kill Here my comes ally. Principia. Very, very quickly. Just trying to hold him off. He only gets one. He only not able to find another. This wall's up. Spike planted. Spike goes down. Gun here. Toxins going up. Kobe will be able to res one. We find one, we find two. One enemy Give me another one, Joe. No ammo! But it's okay because Abu is there. Very nice retake there from the Eagles. Good res there from Jacoby, and we will be able to hold off Principia for one more My round. Does not end. Ask for aid and you shall receive. Seven to three, Principia is up.
Standing ahead. Holy cow, we saw everybody. Keelan just holding this angle, waiting for the jet to peak. Yeah, everybody's holding the jet right now. Principia will be on the move to B site here, though. Good have knife. Knife deployed. One will find one. I think Joe realizes he can see for that. Joe will go down. There's one planted. back sight. Abu not able to find him. One more will go down. Jacoby finds that kill. 3v2 here for the Eagles. Last player standing. Jacoby will go down. Flashback. Oh, and Keelan will go down. 8-3, to three. nice win there from Principia. Last round before the Last switch. round before we go over to attack. Principia is up 8-3. to three. Eagles making, trying to make this one 8-4. to four. We are able to buy some guns. That is what you need to say. with some fancy feet oh nice job from the Eagles we find a bunch that's massive we do have spike down as well who is just gonna be holding potentially that mid cross he's gonna go back over to a I think is a great choice this Prince of Pia has backed off a bit Number four here, Luke is holding mid. He will have some company. One enemy he remaining. finds one. Gives Abu the info Abu needs. Abu peeks. Nice shots here. The Eagles make this one four to eight going into halftime. Switching sides. Maybe that was the spark they needed. Now we have some attack. There. Let's see what the Eagles choose to do first on round number one in their attack. They are down four, but these rounds go fast. The tides can turn. Let's see what we can do here. Eagles look like they're just going to split here. Sage wall is up. On B, it's going to cover all of that cross. Meanwhile, Joe has made his way up into tube. He's going to get found out, though. Sage Wall is about to break, though, on this cross. Just popping some shots here at the jet. Sage wall has broken. Oh, that is a one shot Sage. 
Wall's gonna go up. Thirty seconds left. Bomb gets planted. Healing. All of the eagles on this back side. Joe taking some pop shots. That we did see them. Oh, that's a flank on yellow there. Standing ahead. Eagles find a few. Keelan will go down though. Abu will also go down. Jacoby not able to hold the line. Good first round here coming in from Principia. Here. Eagles did get bombed down. So we do have a little bit of cash right from that, but Principia will be buying. Eagles are making their way over here. Kobe is going to get found. Down a. That is going to be Spike as well. Suppressive. Knife is going to get destroyed. We do not know who all there. is here. Joe will get taken down in mid. Keelan will get taken down in a main. Eagles are now very, very split. See what they want to do here. Last oh. player standing. Flawless. Flawless there from Principia. Nice angles being held. And they will take that Enemy. round, making this one 10 to 4. Eagles are able to buy some weapons now. And they need to go on a streak. Eagles are looking like they might want to go A here. Need to be aware that this jet is going to be holding up here. Luke is up on the generator. Joe will find one. Not able to check that back box. If people get taken down. Three go down for the Eagles. This is a 3v3. Or two go down for the Eagles. Oh, nice job there, the Eagles. Making sure that bomb does not get defused by that wall. What the heck? One enemy remaining. Abu versus the Killjoy. And Abu is going to take it. Very nicely done. The Eagles got one. Need to turn that one into a few now. Here we go, walls are about to come down. Let's see what we can do here. Keelan's gonna be taking job top generator. Knife is in. Knife will not find anybody. Keelan did spot out that sage. Eagles will 
take front of sight. Sage wall is in. Luke was able to get that kill on the back side. Luke is kind of trapped at the moment. I believe that Principia knows this. Yep, they do know that. Two go down here for the Eagles. No one on spike yet. Last player standing. Oh, and Keelan is gonna get shot on the rope. Principia able to take this one. Making it 10. Now 11 to 5. You failed. Now flee. They need two more rounds to take Icebox. Eagles, not much credit action. They will spend what they can. They need to string together some rounds very, very quickly. Thank you. Get out of my way! Keelan is gonna go down. We know that Jet has an op as well as knives. There is a sage wall. Shots. He does have this phantom with him. Eagles will go ahead and just back out of this one. Do know that there is an op here. Very, very careful. Thirty seconds left. Spike down B. Nice job. <laughs> Bomb needs to get planted and it will start to go down. Ten seconds left. Ten seconds to go, Abu the last down, one. B. Last player standing. He will not be able to survive that one. Twelve to five. Principia is up. Match point. And this is match point for them. See what the Eagles choose to do here. They are stacking over here by A. This op has moved over here, so the Eagles need to be very, very careful not to get caught out. Hard made it close. Up and popped by the KO. There's the flash. And we will have all of Principia off of sight here. Okay, ultimate is down now. That spike gets planted. Comes two Sova drones. You know, trying to work them fancy feet. Randomly got a kill through the smoke. Last pair is Jacoby. Finds one, finds two. Not able to find the third great try there from Jacoby. And game number two will go to Principia. It is over. Defenders win. The snow should hide our tracks. We were never here.
We will go into map number three just as soon as we see the scoreboard, which will be Haven.
Alrighty, folks. Game number three. Principia won Icebox 13 to 5. The Eagles won Lotus 13 to 6. So we are moving on to map number three, which is Haven. Very excited for this one. The Eagles will be defending first. Principia has already locked in the KJ, the Omen, and the Sova. Eagles are hovering Breach, Raze, Omen, and KJ. Abu swapping between Sova and Fade. KJ is locked in for the Eagles. Our whole comp just locked in at the same time. So we will have Breach, Raze, Sova, Omen, and Killjoy. Principia, we're seeing what they're going to roll with. They have... A KJ, a Sova, a Breach, a S ah, KJ, your Omen, a Breach, a Sova, and a Jet is locked in. So pretty similar team comps. We have a Raze, they have a Jet. We've all, we've, I mean, the only different map was Lotus. Everything else has kind of been the same. So here we go. We're going in round number one. The Eagles will be defending first. On beautiful Haven. I'm going to toss it into this, and then I'm going to do that, and then I'm going to do this, and then we're going to do that, and then we're going to be bad. There we go. Didn't even know that you left, huh? So round number one, the Eagles are defending for the first half. So Jacoby will be on the KJ, Joe on the Omen, Abu on Sova, Luke is going to be on Raze, and Keelan on this Breach. Looks like Principia is going to be stacked up around mid. Let's see what they want to do here. Alarm bot out. We will see a stun in the mid. Cover going out. Joe has thrown stuff over by C. Oh, we're gonna have Ooh, nice shots here from Abu. He's gonna find two. One Jacoby finds team. one more, and just like that, we are gonna have Okay! Round number one, the Eagles are up one to nothing. I didn't even see any of the kills. I think I saw one of the kills. I'm a horrible caster! So Abu picked up two, Joe picked up two, and Jacoby picked up one. Very nice, very nice. Turned out. So the Eagles will buy some weapons, and it looks like we might see a lot of stuff Taking heavy over here by Garage once again. Oh, nice job there from Jacoby. He finds a bunch. Principia is going to get the heck out of there now. Bomb will still hang around by Garage. Principia is getting back by their spawn. Joe does have a flank. 
Joe's gonna get found out. He's gonna get the heck out of there. He does hear them coming very, very quickly. Stealing sight. Oh, they're all blind. Oh, Joe was enemy bullets! Sag. Oh, nice job there from Luke. It is the Battle of the Flashes. And Luke is playing some Ring Around the Rosie. Nice job there from Keelan. Finds the kill onto the breach. Two to nothing, Eagles. So round number three coming in. The Eagles will be ecoing. Principia will have a full buy. Who's gonna be shooting a dart over here by me? Standing ahead. Little pixel. So Jacoby's gonna go down first. Unideal. Patatees, patatees. Abu might get a little saucy here. Okay, saucy he does get! Finds a kill. Is only 11 health though. Keelan is playing back B with this Bulldog. Joe needs to be very, very careful here. Does not have... Yep, that was unideal. Principia will take sight. Spike planted. Spike goes down. Looks like Luke might have a massive flank. Blinding. Very Dead. nice job there. Keelan finds one. The Eagles will get the heck on sight. The Eagles need to be get going soon here. Prince Pia will find one. Third. Find one. Last Trying to find the kill on the ray or the jet. Not gonna find it. Luke's gonna get the heck out of there with a weapon. Hey, thank you so much, Snappy. Appreciate ya. So Principia will find their first round. Two to one. Eagles are able to buy up. Luke did a good job there, just kinda holding his weapon. See what we can do here. No ultimates online for anybody just yet. Round number four. Behind me. See what we can do. He was able to find one. Not able to find any more though, so there is a trade. Oh, Abu got a little bit too greedy there with his dart. Did find a lot of them, though. Keelan gonna have to play back off of sight. Joe coming in with a flank. Spike planted. Spike gets planted. Joe is gonna get some timing. Will not be able to do much with it. Try to get that kill. Keelan finds one, and we are tied up two to two. Two to two. Only difference: Prince P has weapons. The Eagles do not. So we got to get a little bit mixy here. Looks 
like. Prince Pia will be going fast here. They do know where Kobe is. Nice shots there from Keelan. Does find one. Able to keep him off for just a short time. Prince Pia has decided to get the heck out of there. They are coming over by a boo. You see this though. Praying and praying in mid. Gun here. Clearing out. Shot that. Nice planted. shots there. Oh, Spike gets planted. Is a three v three here. Gun here. Do have breach ultimate. Revealing here we go. Nice shots there. Joe finds one. Keen's gonna swing. Finds one. Finds the other. That breach was trying to ult. And Keelan picking up a four piece. Very, very nicely done. Shut up and let me work. Spike will be defused. The Eagles there did not have many weapons to work with. They only had the friendship in their hearts. They made it happen. Here we go. Next round coming at you. Eagles are up three to two. Revealing area. Abu needs to be careful. Be careful, Abu. Be careful, Abu. Abu has been careful. Principia has made their way close. You should run. Here comes the KJ lockdown. Might get it though. Oh, who finds one? Who finds him. two? Off your feet. We are not able to kill the KJ lockdown. Abu did get off of sight though. Run, Abu! So three players are detained. Luke will find one. Abu is just dodging everything. Nice. Oh my goodness! Nice spray transfer there from Keelan. I don't know how the heck he was able to control that. The Eagles will find that round win. Holy cow. Out. Right there. Knives online. Joe knows that they're coming. Concussing. Right there. Bomb is going to be planted here. On to the site. Luke goes down. Boom might be able to catch up this omen. This omen is expecting some kind of flank here. Nice job there. So we will find one. We have gotten back sight. This jet does have a massive flank. Joe finds him though. Abu will also go down. Joe found another. The Eagles will be able to defuse. Joe picks up a four piece. Very nicely done. Five to two. The Eagles are up. Turn out. Placing form grenade. Looks like Principia will be looking to go over here by C site. Here we go. Don't know why the windows noise keeps happening. Joe. Ah, oh, he missed the one piece. So 
Kobe did find one before he went down. Joe finds another. Joe looking for one more, not able to find it. Even might have a massive flank. Here comes the Sova Derricks. Not able to find him. Keelan is playing close here. There's the Sova drone. Find one. Not able to find the other. But it might be enough. Here comes that bomb. One enemy oh my goodness, that is a wall bang? Not ready yet. We are able to see one of them. Last needs to peek. Standing. Nice job there. The Eagles will find that round win. I was going to say kill. Abu, I am going to be honest with you, buddy. You and you That's can uh, clip this if you want. You totally baited Luke there. 100%. But hey, you got the kill. So I'm alright with it. 6-2 to two overall. Joe is picking up an op. Placing swarm grenade. Placing swarm grenade. So we do have breach alt as well as KJ alt. So let's see what happens. Placing alarm bomb. KJ drone should be able to see. Yep. Destroyed. Eagles know that they are coming. Oh. Not, or uh, Jacoby not able to get that kill. Ray's going in. Who needs to be very careful? Last player standing. Okay, just like that. I think Joe might want to save this Spike op. Planted. There is a five of them alive. And Joe is but one. Joe is gonna go ahead and just save this one. Shadows traveling. So if people are very weirded out. Joe is saving his op. This is a very, very expensive weapon because it kills in one shot. So he's just going to let that bomb explode. Let Principia have that round and not risk Principia peeking up his op. Here we go, round number 10. Eagles are up Good six job. to three. Three more rounds in this half. Luke needs a drop. I will be their nightmare. Here we go. Placing alarm bot. Alarm That's gonna kill down. the alarm bot. Ah, it down. Oh, Luke almost had that spray transfer on a few down. more of them. See. Luke finds yeah. one. My ult's ready. We do have ultimate for this retake. Spike planted. Spike gets planted. Joe will find one. Player standing. Joe, one v two. Still in sight. Cover going out. I believe that Principia knows exactly where he is. One enemy finds remaining. one. Finds the second. Nice transfer there from Joe. He will pick up the round for the Eagles. Very nicely done. You forget your place. Very nicely done. Seven to three. Two more rounds in the half. Right after this game, just a heads up for everybody, we will be transferring right to Overwatch. We will be starting that game just a little bit late. That's all right. Okay. 
Scanning ahead. Right here. We might get a little frisky here. Uh, uh, uh. Not find any. Really good try there. Able to get a few of them low. That breach is one shot. Jet got a little bit low as well. Joe does have a really, really nice angle here. But they do know he is up here now. He's gonna get the heck out of there. Blinding. Principia has rotated off of A, and it looks like they are going through mid. They've smoked off that mid connector. Eagles know that they're coming. Out. Off your feet! Joe got unlucky there. Satchel out. 30 seconds left. Nice job there from Luke. He did find that kill, but bomb still got planted. One enemy left. It is that jet, and she is full flanking. Nobody knows, but Luke knows. Very nicely done. The Eagles take that one, making this 8 to 3. Very nice ultimate there from Luke. Picked up two. Last round in the half. Spend everything. We are going into the Keep final moving. round of the first half. Can I get this? Thanks. Placing sentry. Here we go. It looks like Principia is going to be potentially Shadows looking over here by. Mid. Joe picks up one. Get the heck out of there. Cover going out. Joe is alive. He finds another. Nice kills there from Joe. You're not. Oh, we do take down the KJ lockdown. One enemy left here. And the Eagles get it done. Nicely done. Good round there. Joe able to find out exactly where they're coming from. Gave the Eagles enough information. And now we need three rounds to take this game. Looks like the Eagles will be shading over to A. Here we go. Second half coming at you. Eagles do spot one out. Enemy tank. He's gonna get tagged here. He's able to get the heck away. He always made his way up. He is tagged though. Looks like the Eagles will be getting off of sight there. I believe that Keelan might have saw one. Definitely heard that footstep in mid. Nice try. Oh, I got away from that. Nice pick there. Eagles have actually made this full rotation over back to A. Sova is the only one that knows. Keelan is one shot. Just gonna be peeking here. Uh, nice okay. shots there. Keelan just left. fighting the demons in mid. He will go down. What the heck? Don't know why that happened. Spike is down. Joe will get picked off. It is a 3v3. Eagles will peek. Able to find one. Do say hi up in heaven. 
One enemy remaining. Luke got that kill. And the Eagles set up a nice crossfire there. And we will take the first round of the second half. Here we go. It looks like we might just be doing a little bit of a default. See what we can see. Eagles do have some weapons. Principia is choosing to also buy here. They do know that they need these rounds, so they need to force. So Omen does have a marshal in the back. Keelan needs to be very, very careful about this. Random shot there. I don't think he knew he was there, but being tardasting. So Keelan will have this flank here. Nice job there from Joe. Looking for another one with the final shot. He is going to get the kill. Oh, Keelan's going to get clipped. Joe's just gonna go ahead and spray and pray on that one. I believe that we know that some are in. Not able to get that one done. One enemy Joe able to get that kill. Joe is spraying and praying all over the place. Very nicely done. Round... What are we on? 15? I can't count. This is round 15. Round 14 belongs to the Eagles. We are into round 15. Round 14? Round 15? I don't know. It's already... I have three more games to cast, ladies and gents. Be nice to me. Snuff them out. Here we go. The Eagles will be ecoing here. Don't get spotted! Why are we peeking, Luke? Almost got that kill. Joe will be creeping up mid, though. Find one. Oh, noey! Joe will go down, but... Keelan might have a massive flank here. Oh, two go down for the Eagles in mid. Last player standing. And Jacoby Spike goes down, down in spawn. Keelan, the last one up. 4v1 for him. Left. That was interesting. <laughs> 16 seconds to go here in this round. Keelan, I don't think he's going to be able to get these kills. But hey, he might just... Left. Oh. Rusty Doobie spraying through some oaks. He will pick up that win for... Let's do this! Principia. The Eagles will be able to buy full here. Principia is trying to eco as much as they possibly can. I tell you, the Eagles are going to choose to save. that jet. We also see that Sova. Come on, Joe. Almost had it. Oh, nice shot there from Keelan. The 
Displaying drone. Enemy mark. One will go down for the Eagles. Not able to get that trade. Blue's on sight. And Principia will hold the line. This one is 5 to 11. The Eagles need two. But they will have some weapons. We are going to see Principia buying up weapons as well. So they have done enough to make this match even. They will also have an op. That is terrifying. Come into the unknown. very quickly. Bomb site is clear. Eagles do have a lot of room here. Bomb is going to get planted. Joe finds one. They're looking for another. He's going to get the heck out of there. Joe finds one more. For that jet. Oh, he did find an exit kill there. You have brimstone alts. One enemy nice job there. They're all dead. Good use of brimstone or uh, breach alt. I'm sorry. Match we'll get point. them off of the point and match point for the Eagles. All they need is one more round to win this game. have guns Principia they have a few weapons and some armor Let's see what the Eagles choose to do here we only have omen alt they have so alt as well as jet knives and they have an omen alt to match it Let's see what the Eagles do here jet knives are out jet knives do hit even will find one that's unlucky. Number two here. Joe, massive flanks. The Eagles have taken sight. Joe finds one more. Last one is the Omen. Does get the kill on Luke, though. The Eagles are just going to get the heck out of here. Play for information. Charges. Is this gonna be the last Cussing. round? Nice concuss there for Kila. Jacoby needs to be very, very careful. Here comes the Sova ult. And the Eagles will win it. GG's all around. Principia will go down after forcing this into a game number three. GG's to them, though. Tons and tons of fun. That was a very, very close match. The Eagles remain undefeated. Win this one 13-5. Thank you all for being here. Please stick around. We have some Overwatch coming up very, very shortly. We'll see you back here shortly.
where it's a little unfair that I'll never not care about you. And I don't wanna say, but the second that I wait, no, the words can't get to you. We push and we pull, it's wrong and it's right, it's not black and white. But I know.
to Nepal. Alrighty, alrighty, folks. Let me get the other team name. This is... University of Guam. I put that in the wrong side! I need this way! University of Guam. All right, that looks correct. Welcome back, Eagles fans, as we have some Overwatch coming at you. We are still on our delay per the league rules. University of Guam, they got map choice, and they chose Nepal. We saw Nepal on Saturday against Northwood. The Eagles will be starting on the right-hand side. Guam is on top on your left-hand side, and we will see some brawl here. Gotta love some brawl. The Eagles will be running brawl. Guam will be running brawl. We are gonna get into it. Game number one, best of five tonight. We are on a control map, so you have to win two of the three control maps. Let's get into it. Looks like the Eagles will get the point first. We'll stay on Symmetra. I like it. Versus Guam. You see that they have a Bastion. Eagles just kind of playing out of sight. Oh, Lexi is going to get taken down very, very quickly. Unideal. Eagles will be staying on point here. We do take point first. Taking a ride there, Luke. Trying to stay up. University of Guam will flip this point, though. Just like that. They got that early pick there onto Lexi. Gave them enough room. And University of Guam. Protecting point. They do have this Bastion. So Bastion is going to be dealing a ton of damage. The Eagles just now recollecting themselves. Here we go. We'll TP to the left side of point. We will take point. All five people on point here. We'll be very, very careful. They do take point here. What's he doing? Was she going to keep everybody healed up? Here comes the Reinhardt. He will go down. Jacoby is absolutely one shot. There goes his shield. He goes need to play side of point. They are doing that beautifully. We see a res that Mercy will go down. We will trade it out, though. Big beat drop from both teams. Hammer down goes down. Jacoby with a massive shatter. Very nicely done. The Eagles will keep point. James going to go back and hurry to get Luke. Speed him back. University of Guam, they will come in with a Junkrat now and a Ana. So they're switching off of that Cassidy and that Mercy. We've taken some shots here. There is a massive, when I say massive, I mean massive, window. Coach D, Braden, and Sarah rooting for the team. Hey, thank you so much. Just as I say that, Jacoby be do going in! Watch out! Very nicely done. The Eagles win another fight. 85% captured here. We will see a Bastion ult. We'll be all around point. That one's gonna find James. Hammer down, we'll find two, but we will be able to keep this one 99 and 100% no one from Guam able to touch and the Eagles will take the first one on Nepal Braden and Sarah hello hello I'm sorry I cannot see you all tonight hope you're all having a very fun time in Madison though so the Eagles are gonna be swapping here 
These days, being myself, is you swap over enough. to a ball. Looks like we're gonna go with our Fara comp. Guam does have a Fara. They also have a Bastion and a Lucio. I'm interested to see if they keep this Lucio. I bet you they roll over to Mercy. Yep, we are gonna see Mercy. We are not gonna see Fara though. Here we go. We're gonna be hopping in with Luke in the skies. Jacoby has made his way all the way over. Big damage there from Luke already. Jacoby looking for his shot to go in. Here he comes. Big slam. The Eagles find the first pick. Lots of damage going in onto that Bastion. You see this Diva touch? Nice hack there onto her. Oh, that Diva is going to get D-Mech from the Eagles. They will have the first point secured. We do find that Lucio. That is the target we need to get. And we do. Diva will go down as well. Oh, the Eagles. This is a kill box right here. The Eagles will find a team kill right away. We will see some swaps from Guam. They will go over to a soldier instead of a Cassidy. Getting ready to just kind of hack somebody. Nice damage here from Luke. He will go in on the back line, finding the Kiriko. Nice hack there. Jacoby is going to go down early, though. Diva is going to get that Lucio out. Cassidy's absolutely won. Luke will find one. James is keeping Luke all healthy and good to go. Nice hack there onto the soldier. Oh, nice rocket there from Luke. It's going to find its mark. Baby Diva. Last one here. Nice job here, but there are supports here from Usurper C. Guam. They're going to get the heck out of there, though. I would as well. So we are probably going to see an EMP to start off this fight. We are going to see a swap over to Ramatra on the tank side. The Eagles are holding very close here to this choke. Keelan spotting everybody out. Does see that swap over to the Ramatra. Here we go. Let's see what they want to do. Rocket Barrage goes in. Keelan only leading off with a hack. Eagles looking for the Lucio. The direct rocket's going to find it. And a team kill for the Eagles. Cassidy. Will be high nooning. EMP goes out. We find the Cassidy. Minefield out. And Nepal goes to the Eagles. We're not going to be able to see if we can play the game. Sad. But game number two coming at you very, very shortly. Stay tuned.
we are on beautiful Periso. This is the hybrid pick from University of Guam. They had choice of map since they lost the first one. And we are into it. The Eagles will be defending first. Periso is a hybrid, like I said. There is a giant point. We saw this against Northwood, so this is going to turn gray. You have to capture this point to 100%. And then out comes a giant truck, which you will see on the back side of this. Well, it's in here. It's going gonna, it's gonna to spawn here, I promise. There's going to be a giant truck that spawns. You have to push that truck through a series of checkpoints. There are two checkpoints on Pariso. Hit those checkpoints. And earn those times. So, what you want to do is you want to capture all the points as fast as you possibly can. But here we go. Luke is one shot already without his mercy. That's just an ideal. James, can you jump, brother? Alrighty, so. The Eagles will be on the left side of your screen. They will be defending first. University of Guam will be on the right side of your screen attacking first. So this is game number two coming at you. This is best of five, so you have to win three maps total. Here we go. Luke is finding some hits there. We realize that they have a Ramatra as well as a Soldier. Even already in the back line. Does see that Mercy, Mercy has flown in. Nice job there. Now we're looking for this soldier. Soldier's gonna go down. Keelan will go down. The Eagles might be able to resurrect that. We'll see. Yep, resurrect does go in. Keelan is back up. Always helps to have a Mercy. So we do see a swap from a soldier over to an Ash. Keelan. He's gonna look for this ash here. Nice hack there on Viana. Keelan trying to take care of business, not able to do so. Oh, that is a very close ash. Keelan trying to take care of her, not gonna be able to do so. That's oh, Luke is gonna go down. Two DPS are down as well as our Mercy. Lexi is trying to work on point here. She's going to have EM or she's gonna have nano here in a moment. Needs to be very, very careful. It is gonna get the nano off on Jacoby. High noon coming in. It's going to find its mark, but the Eagles are back. We are fighting for this point. Lexi will go down. And this point will be captured by University of Guam. We will go into the second part of this map. This is the push. Or I guess the escort part. This part of the map is very, very good for Farah. Lots of tight lanes, a lot of spots that just have amazing splash damage potential. Keelan does have EMP, let's see if he goes in with it. Luke will go down early. The game is still winnable here, or this fight is still winnable. Luke is not going to be able to be res. Let's see if the Eagles do invest into EMP. Well, they'll get this hack onto the Ana. Luke is back. University of Guam has had an easy job kind of pushing this all the way through this point. There goes the EMP. The Eagles will find a bunch. Team kill for them. That is what you needed to see. Nice recovery there by the Eagles. Over there. Now we gotta keep this point. Flash damage. See if the 
Eagles want to go early. We don't have EMP anymore, but we do have Barrage. Just is going to rain from above. A lot of damage going in. For Matra, it's going to be absolutely one shot. Where she's going to res. Kobe is 23 health. Trying to push his... Oh, Lexi's actually going to find a kill here. Lexi's just DPSing. That's what you like to see. If you have Nano available. Let's see what the Eagles choose to do here. Matra just trying to poke out Luke. He does use form here. Keelan is behind everybody. Hack there onto the Mercy. Luke needs to get back out of there. We do have a Nano. Finds one. Looking for a few more, though. So there's going to be two Nanos out. It's a skill issue. Very nicely done. Off this from is still up. Lexi's going to take care of it. Eagles still have good control here. Luke's going back to pick up James. We are back into it. So Keelan is by their spawn, already telling us where they are, where they're going. EMP is available. Nice hack there. Looking for this Ash. We are going to find her. Justice reigns from above. We find a few. Jacoby's getting the heck out of there. There is a Ramatra. Oh, nice sleep there from Lexi. 50 seconds to go here. We do see a swap from Ramatra over to D.Va now. On the side of University of Guam. The EMP is available for the Eagles. Comes the EMP. Keelan's gonna get absolutely clipped. Ooh, Luke takes care of that one. Kobe's trying to stay alive. Oh, nice job there from Luke. He's 60 HP. He needs to be very, very careful. Five seconds to go here. University of Guam needs to touch. Bob is going to be able to touch here. We are in overtime. Diva is very, very one shot. We are going to see a Nano Tara. Finds a few. Justice Reigns from above. High Noon does not touch. Someone is on point. Baby Diva. Taken down. Team kill for the Eagles. And that is the half. Round one done. Now it's the Eagles' turn for their attack. Switching sides. Initiating match. Second round of Pariso coming at you. The Eagles looking to push it. They have to first capture the point, unlock the payload, then push it 111.19 meters to beat the length that University of Guam did. They will then take map number two, but a lot stands in between that. So here we go. Ready. See what the Eagles choose to roll with here. Luke is on Hanzo. Keelan is on... Each one. Keelan is on... What is this character name? Widowmaker. That's what I wanted to say. Guys. It's been a long time, alright? Been streaming for two and a half hours. I was doing Valorant before this. I still got League of Legends to go. Woo! It's a great day to be an Eagle. Here we go. Edgewood College's go attack. Into my web. Ten seconds. Yeah. Looks like Luke will stick what? with this Hanzo. We are going to have double sniper. We are not going to have double sniper anymore. Yeah, I figured this 
Jacoby's just gonna say hey to everybody up there. Keelan's trying to just get behind everybody. Oh, nice direct rocket. Keelan's actually capping points. I don't believe that Blom knows this. Nope, now they do. Eagles have taken a good amount of point already. The rockets are going to rain from above. Finds the Kiriko. Last one on point is the Sigma, and he will go down. Nice job there from the Eagles, and we will be able to take this point. Now we're looking for some kills here. Eagles have part one done. Keep this going. Some nice shots there from that Cassidy. Kellen is going to be setting up here shortly. Oh. Just randomly, the soldier is going to be able to find Keelan there. Jacoby doing a good job of just being annoying on top of these houses. I like it. We do have Nano available. Let's see if we want to use it here. That's exactly what I figured we were going to do. Just right from above. Finds both supports. Finds another. Lex is going to get taken down. We will take down the Cassidy. We will have three on cart. We are going to find that Diva. Diva is going to get caught out. Demek. Baby Diva is going to be left alive. We do have EMP. Nice job there. We are going to find that kill. Here go the next one to touch. EMP goes out. Keelan trying to find one. Does not. Ash is the last one alive. Actually, no, she's not. Keelan, Jacoby hit a shot, brother. But it's all right. The Eagles will take map number two. Very nicely done. I want to see the play of the game, but that's alright. We'll be back with map number three. And we are on some Route 66 to start off with. To start off with? No, not to start off with. On map number three. The Eagles are up two to nothing here in total map count. We are looking for one more. University of Guam looking to push this one to a map four and then a map five. They need to tr string together three wins in a row. Go the Eagles again on the left side. They will be defending first. Ready for battle. University of Guam will be attacking first. There is always room for improvement. We will be on our Farrakhan. Supplying damage increase. Emergency in 
Her mother's work is not. If you ever need help, just fly to me, Angela. <laughs> Alrighty. Huh? Game number three coming at you. That's what I'm going for. See what we can do. Five, four, three. See University of Guam rolling with a soldier, an Ana, a Cassidy, a Ramatra, and a Mercy. Looking for something here. Let's spot out the Mercy. Nice hack there onto the Mercy. Keelan. Oh, nice job there from Keelan. Gets the kill. Almost had that. So I think we're going to be able to res that. We are. Good job there from Jacoby. Going to create some space. We will go back in. Nice slam there onto the Soldier 76. Have Moira, we see a more of a swap. Moira's gonna go down. Eagles have their tension split here. Keelan doing a good job here in the back. There goes the Cassidy. We'll be able to take a little bit of space here. Keelan is back, so we are able to kind of Give a little bit of space here. Jacoby just kind of waiting to see. We do see a swap from that Ramatra over to a Diva. Nice hack there. We are going to find that Ana. We are also going to find the Moira. Jacoby here. Trying to get out. Do you see a swap over? I think I heard a Widow. Did I hear a Widow? We do hear. Do you hear a widow? The Eagles will prioritize this widow as much as they possibly can. Just like I said, there she goes. Rocket Barrage in on the D.Va. Moira tries to come in and help out. She is going to go down. Nice kills there from the Eagles. We will continue to hold this choke point. So we'll see a swap over to Winston and a Bastion now. A lot of changes here for University of Guam. Lots of damage there. EMP goes out. Massive slam there. We're gonna get the heck out of there now. Luke setting his sights on this Ana. On a one shot. Misses the sleep. Elon, nice hack there onto the Bastion. Bastion will fall. Eagles continue to hold. Winston will be pushing card here. Bubble is down. Oh, Keelan's going to be hacking this Bastion on the back side. Is going to be able to take care of him as well. Here comes the minefield. Bastion will go... Or, I'm sorry, Baptiste will go down. Rocket Barrage comes in. Job there, Jacoby. Just keeping everything healthy there is Lexi. We do have Nano available, so that's going to be a massive alt. Do you swap back over to Widow? Oh, we do see a Reinhardt as well. Big slam there. Widow is absolutely one shot, will go down. Here comes Luke with the nano. High noon comes in. Will find the Baptiste. James will go down. This is the last fight here. There goes the Reinhardt. Oh, Luke is going to get taken down. But that is going to be it. Damage was done. Score. The Eagles Zip. able to hold very, very close. Now it is time for our attack. We need to push it farther than 28.93 meters Initiate to win this game.
University of Guam needs to play some perfect Overwatch here. Looks like the Eagles will probably be rolling with the same comp. We do see a Far and a Ash come out of University of Guam. Let's see if that is what they keep. Yep, that is going to be what they keep. So we are going to see two Fars flying around in the sky. One for the Eagles, one for University of Guam. Eagles looking to push this a little bit. Keelan will be on this Widow. Gonna see if he can get a quick pick right off the bat. Five, four, three, two, we are one. in. Attackers see if Keelan can get a quick pick. Does get a shot there. Oh my goodness, that was almost a one shot. Direct there onto the far up. Big slam there. Oh, good sleep there from Yana. Nice job there. We do find that far up. Eagles continue to push this one. And just like that, University of Guam not able to stay on point. The Eagles will win this one tonight, three to nothing. GG's to University of Guam. Good luck to them, yep, just like Lexi said, good luck in the next few matches for them. Leave this. But... That is gonna be it for us tonight. For Overwatch, we are gonna stay live. All right, we are going to stay live. We will be back on in one hour. All right, one hour. Hang out. Don't hang out. Go do something. But in an hour, we will start up with League of Legends. They will be taking on Missouri University of Science or Technology and Science. All righty. So we hope to see you all here for that. We will be back in just a wee bit. Stay tuned for some League of Legends.
Say the life's too short to be holding this tight. So why am I walking light? And in this world of light and color, I'm not afraid of the night when this future's so bright. Yeah, I got all these friends, and we're like, it's not the end. Whoa, this new world is out. And I can feel in my bones The horizon is close now, now, now And the world's been changing lately But after the storm We come out strong now, now And I got all these friends And we're like, it's not the end Whoa, still Took our love and I put it on ice This bed is cold and it don't feel right Ain't nobody else could love me like that You love me like that, no If you give me space then I'll give you the sky Yeah, you got me thinking we could try, try, try Ain't nobody else could love me like that You love me like that When I said it's over Thought I really meant that Now I'm wanting you back So just hold me closer Ain't nobody like Come on and love me like you 
been chilling, watching the ocean with you. Baby, up with a slow motion crew. And we up in the growlings when people change, but not us. And we just chilling, kicking it, kissed by the sun. Could be soaked to the skin in the monsoon. I know she got the good vibes when seasons change, but when.
I'm on my own, broken and long. I feel the rain crashing down. All around this empty town, I'm searching for the lost and found. But you don't care, yeah, I'm aware. Keep moving like the scars aren't even there. It's in the air, like a blazing flare. Just stay, cause the flames will burn us. I thought you were the one for me. That's why I gave you everything. How would you close by the stormy seas? Oh, you meant the world to me. I used to kiss your head when you cried for me. Shadows in the atmosphere, charting the stratosphere. I prayed for you and kept you near, and hopes you chase away my fears. I'm on my own, you made it so. Points in blaming you, you did not know. Oh. I thought you were the one for me, that's why I give you everything. How would you cross by the stormy seas? So oh, you meant the world to me.
To see
close till I get up. Time is barely on our side. I don't want to waste what's left. The storms we chase are leading us. And love is all we'll ever trust. Yeah. No, I don't want to waste what's left. And I
times we had I see it now, I see it now Real love, now I break through To show to you that I'm more good than I am bad I work it out, I work it out Alrighty, folks, we are back at it with the stream. The Eagles will be taking on Missouri University of Technology and Science. The Eagles will be on the red side on the right-hand side first. MS&T will be on the left side in blue. And we are in the first round of picks and bands. So far... MSNT has banned out Zed and Akshan. We have banned out Aurelian Soul. Our next band coming in here. The starting lineup for tonight. Program Dallas will be up in the top lane. Unseen Blade will be in the jungle. Jason will be roaming mid. So we have Alex up top, Zeke jungle, Jason mid, Abood ADC. And Dylan will be our support. And we have just banned out Annie. The final band coming out from SN MSNT will be Tristana. Final band from the Eagles. Let's see what it will be. Will be a Mumu. We are in the first round of picks, and Maokai has been picked up by MSNT. The Eagles hovering Zaya. Zaya is locked in. Followed up with a Rakan, maybe? Yumi is gonna get hovered. And Soraka is gonna get locked in. So our bot lane has been shown. We will be rolling with a Zaya Soraka bot lane. Aatrox is going to be hovered. For MST. Let's see if they want to lock that in. They will lock it in. Siver is going to get hovered here. And just a heads up for everybody, we do still have a three minute delay on. The stream has been going on since Valorant, so I will be three minutes ahead of whatever comments you have. So Siver is locked in. Garen is going to get hovered here for the Eagles. Aaron is locked in. We are into the second round of the ban stage. Eagles will have their choice here. Hey, if 
like here. Will be a Vex ban. Now this one goes over to MST. They will ban out Swain. The Eagles, their final ban of game number one. This is a best of three, by the way. Just a heads up. Eagles final ban. Will be Syndra. Final ban for MST. If I want your opinion, will be I'll by. beat it out of you. The Eagles now have their pick. See if they choose to roll with their jungler or their mid laner. J4 is going to get locked in. MST now has two choices. Nautilus is going to get locked in. Zillion is being hovered. Ziggs now being hovered. And Ziggs is going to get locked in. So now we have a counter pick for mid lane. Let's see what we choose to do. Four seconds to lock in. And Victor will be locked in. So here are the matchups for game number one. MST will be rolling with an Aatrox top, a Maokai jungle, a Ziggs mid lane, and a Sivir Nautilus bot lane. The Eagles will have a Garen top, J4 jungle, Victor mid with a Zaya and Soraka bot lane. So this one should be a ton of fun. The Eagles again are on the right hand side in the red. MST on the left hand side in the blue. What we are going to do right now is take it into a be right back screen. We will have three minutes to wait for the match to start. And then we will get into it. So stay tuned for match number one coming soon.
Tell me you're no good I'm brushing away to you The weight of you Of my shoulder uh, so Don't wear my cigarette Alrighty, and we are getting into game number one. We are loading in onto the rift. You're waiting. Promise we didn't freeze. We're just waiting. There we go. All right, so I'm gonna put all this stuff up. Controls, chat off. This is gonna go dark really fast. I apologize. Give me a moment. That doesn't say the right stuff. I have to fix this. One second. I'm so sorry. Hope we don't. Welcome. Summoner's Rift. Done. Perfect. Back into the game. 30 seconds until minions spawn. So it looks like Missouri SNT will be running down through bot. Might see a Nautilus flash, might not. Clear out a ward. They will walk out. Minions have spawned. Here we go. J4 will start at his blue. Malkai will start at his blue. And then we will get into this. Nice healthy leash there for Zeke. Nice trade there from Jason. We are going to see this Nautilus. Go in. Good trade there from the Eagles bot lane. Looks like they will reach level two first. Nice dodge there from Dylan. Very nicely done. Level two for the Eagles here. Nice poke damage from Jason. Alex is hanging out in top lane here with his Aatrox. Mistook there from the Nautilus. 
Dylan's doing a little bit of poke as well. like Zeke is up on his top side. We might see a gank. If that Zeke does spot out that Aatrox. Looks like this Aatrox is actually going for Scuttle Crab. Zeke needs to be very, very careful here. He is going to be able to get out. Maokai is here. There goes the nice root there from the Nautilus. Abu needs to be careful. Does get a nice root as well. So first blood goes over to MST. there from Abu. Flash there from the Aatrox. Ooh, Alex will live there with like one HP. Lane is just kind of vibing there. Not too much going on. Big wave up top, though. will be going after the first dragon of this game. It's a very, very good objective to go over very early on, even though they find themselves down a kill. Looks like this Maokai will spot this out. We do have a lot here. The Eagles need to get done with this very quickly. Zeke might get caught out here. There's the root from the uh, Maokai. Oh, nice flash there from Zeke as well. See, we'll try to get the heck out of there. Nice damage in from Alex. Zeke got out. Holy cow. Aatrox is level 6. And there comes the ultimate. Alex is also level 6. I believe he could have killed Aatrox there. Here comes the flash. And the kill. Nice job there from Alex. As he picks up a solo kill in top lane. Here comes the engage by the Nautilus. There is the root. Well, there's a very one-shot Sivir. So trying to get the kill, he's not going to. But there is a victor who's going to pick it up. So Jason did get a nice roam there into bot lane.
So a one-for-one one trade. Massive wave built up here in the top lane. Eagles are looking to rotate here. There is the root on Azaya. Looks like the Eagles will just go ahead and ignore that. Here comes the ultimate from Maokai. It will root Garen. Nice job there, and Zeke is going to get the kill. The Eagles will go ahead and try to get this Rift Herald very, very quickly. Very nicely done. Abu will be farming in the mid lane now. Jason has gone down to bot. So Rift Herald goes to the Eagles. Oh, we will have an engage here. Ultimate from Ziggs. Ziggs will go down. Nice ultimate. Oh, nice ultimate from the Zaya. Abu. Nice job there. Zeke is going to get that shutdown. Very nicely done. going to be back on his chickens. We do see the rotation from Victor. Victor's going to be farming in mid lane now. Both top laners do have their ultimates back up. Level 6 here for Soraka, so that global ultimate is going to come in handy. She does Whenever she has her ultimate up, basically what happens... Ooh. Basically what happens is that she heals everybody on the team for a good amount. Next dragon is up here right now. Let's see if the eagles... What do they want to do with it? Zeke is making his way down. Jason is also. See a lot of action up top. Malkai ultimates are not going to be able to follow up with it. Here comes J er, Zeke. Flash from the Ziggs. Nice job there. Good ultimate coming in from Soraka. Nice ultimate from Zeke. Nice kills there from the Eagles. They will get that dragon. Very nicely done. Great ultimate coming out of the Soraka. Great ultimates held on by Zeke just until the last minute. A really, really good stun there from Jason. He ended up getting three there with his stun. Executed. Dylan's going to go ahead and execute himself. Doesn't want to give up the kill to anybody. Oh, a lot of people here. From MST. So the Eagles will not get that turret. Let's see if they choose to go in. It looks like they will not. Malkai did not have flash and Sor or, uh, Zaya was just out of reach.
Meanwhile, Top is still in an island. Hanging out. Oh, here comes... Oh, potential gank there from the Nautilus just misses. Alex just kind of vibing out up on top lane. Lots of damage going on up in top lane. Looks like the Eagles will be looking to gank. Eh, maybe not. They will head over to mid lane. The Ziggs needs to be very, very careful. Ziggs will back there. Nautilus might be a little bit too far out. Lots of damage going on to him. Ooh, there's going to be an engage there from the Nautilus, which I don't think was the right thing to do. Good heals coming in from Dylan. As Zeke will stay alive. Zeke still has his ultimate, so we're going to see if that Sivir walks up and if he's going to use it. Oh, what the heck? <laughs> Zeke pressed that at the wrong time. Basically took the, uh... Took the Maokai back over to the bush. Looks like the Eagles will be going after this next Rift Herald. It is an objective bounty for... Oh, here comes the Maokai R. Dylan will go down. Eagles will be engaging though. Be very, very careful. Boo, nice flash. And nice ultimate. Good silence there on the Aatrox. Sivir will get the shutdown on to Abu. Believe that we did pick up. The Rift Herald. Flash there from the Ziggs. That's what she needed to get. Dylan is going to be holding this mid wave. Meanwhile, MST, they are going to be looking at Dragon. And they will start it. Zeke not able to contest it if he's just backed. That is a good bounty for MST. Let's see if we can get that top turret now. Alex is working on it. And we will take that turret. We'll take that trade. Alex might be able to catch the zigs out. Alex will go in on this zigs. Ultimate from Alex will not kill him, but he will finish it. Nice solo kill from Alex. Very nicely done. Oh, 
Maokai ultimate coming in. Not gonna hit though. Eagles are looking to re-engage on this though. Here comes the Nautilus. Will go in on to Abu. He will get stunned. And will go down. So the Eagles pick up a kill there. Looks like this Aatrox is just waiting behind the Eagles. Is Ziggs ultimate, here comes the Aatrox. Nice ultimate coming out. Dylan trying his hardest to stay alive. Aatrox will go down. Here comes the J4. Nicely done. And the Eagles turn that one into a four piece. Nautilus the only one left up. Rift Herald is summoned in mid lane. There goes one turret. And there goes another turret. We're looking for an in hit. Very nice. Here comes MST. They will be respawning here. Eagles are going to snag a blue buff. Aatrox might be getting caught out here. The Eagles are on this. Alex is going to get the heck out of there now. And here we go. Do you catch that Nautilus? Eagles will now potentially look for Baron. Nope, we are not going to. We're all going to back in that one bush. Leak's going to farm up a bit. Some good fights coming out of the Eagles here. We are up almost 12k gold. Six towers. Two dragons. Next dragon will be up in a minute and 30. If you're asking how the heck I know this, if you look in the bottom right hand corner, you see these timers going down. What the heck? It's doing the thing. There it goes. So you see these timers going down. Each one of those icons gives me a specific heads up of what is coming. So the dragon is on the right hand side in the middle. So a minute 10 now. Then you have the red buff, the blue buff, and the baron for each side. That's how I know. So the Baron belongs to the Eagles. We are going to look for Dragon here. Alex might. Ooh, no. So here we go. The Eagles are going to start to look for this dragon. Zeke is here. And here we go. Dragon is up. See if MST wants to fight for it. I don't think that they can because that dragon has already been slain. Holy cow! That thing went down quick. Eagles are pushing through bot lane. They have some Baron empowered minions. Ziggs is trying to just Cause a disturbance up in top lane. The Eagles are just marching through. Here comes the Maokai ultimate. It will go in on J4, but Maokai is actually brought to the team. Alex will go in. Just like that. Objective bounty for MST. 
That tower is going to be quick work here. Here we go. Ultimates are in. Nice ultimate there from Alex. Eagles find three. Actually, they find four. They're looking for one more. That zigs. The last one is up. And I think game number one is going to be had by the Eagles. And game number two coming at you. The Eagles are up. One to nothing. Let me take a look at the scoreboard real quick. And then I will toss it into a Be Right Back screen. With game number two, we'll be back soon. Don't go anywhere. Game numero dos. We are back into it. MST had their choice of side. They chose to roll with blue side once again. The Eagles will be on the right side in the red. We are into the first round of the bands. Zed banned out by MST. Just so everybody is aware, we have been live for 4 hours and 40 minutes and 35 seconds. Been a long one. So we see the Zaya ban from MST. The Eagles holding true. They ban out that Annie. They ban out Aurelian Soul as well. Third ban from MST will be J4. So two...
characters that we saw last game played by the Eagles, they don't want to see him played again. Final ban in round number one for the Eagles will be the Amumu. First pick here belongs to MST. Maokai has been locked in once again. Caster Dan is the best caster in AO. I once saw Daniel cast an entire day of Overwatch, Super Smash Bros, Valorant, League of Legends, and Rocket League. Some call him Coach D, others call him Danny. But to me, he's my caster. <laughs> Thank you, Luke. <laughs> That must have taken you a second to think about. So Tristana is locked in by the Eagles. Appreciate you, Luke. Second choice here by the Eagles. Let's see what it will be. Lee Sin. MST now has their choice of two champions. They have locked in Maokai. Can be a flex pick in either jungle or support. Caitlyn going to get hovered though. Caitlyn will be locked in. I have one more choice here in the first round of picks. Let's see who they choose. Vex is going to get locked in. The Eagles, let's see what they want to do. They can pick support, can pick top, they can pick mid. Rise is going to get hovered, and Rise is going to get locked in. So both teams showing their ADC, their jungler, and their mid in the first round. You don't see that that often. And we're in the second round of bans. Will ban Nautilus. Ban goes over to MST. Who do they not want to see? The they don't want to see Garen. Ban out Aatrox. The final ban of game number two. Belongs to MST. Let's see what they want to do with it. Three seconds. Mordekaiser banned out. Gotta get the copy copy pastas for the Twitch chat. Lol. Love it. Rakan is gonna get hovered here by the Eagles. Rakan is gonna get locked in. Two choices here. We will see the top laner. We will also see the either support of the jungler. Malkai can still be flexed. He can still be flexed. I mean, he can be flexed in three lanes. He can be flexed jungle, top, or support. Let's see what they do with him. Janna. Yep. Okay, so it is going to be a jungle, Maokai. Janna support.
in the top laner for MST for game number two. Time to work, really appreciate it. Of course, Luke. It's gonna be Camille. So our top lane choice. Let's see what it will be. Will be Malphite. So the Eagles, we will have a Malphite top, Lee Sin jungle, Rise mid. Tristana Rakan bot lane. MST will have a Camille top, Malkai jungle, Vex mid, and a Caitlyn Jana bot lane. So we are going in to the, th the second match of the day. I'll give you a little bit of updates of what happened today. Our Super Smash team had some games earlier on our YouTube page. If you just type into YouTube Edgewood College Esports, you will see it. First game, we had Kelsong take on Buena Vista University. He won 3-0. to zero. This is for Super Smash Bros. Ultimate Singles. Second game for Super Smash Bros. Ultimate Singles was Alexi. She took on Lakeland University and she lost 0-3. to three. Over on our Twitch channel, well, on our Twitch channel, since you're here right now and talking about it, our Valorant team played Principia College. They won 2-1. to one. Very, very fun games there. They're, that continues their undefeated season. After some Valorant, we played a little bit of Overwatch. Overwatch team took on University of Guam. They ended up winning 3-0. to zero. The Overwatch team, again, still remains undefeated. Oh, I should also say that Kelsong is undefeated. And now, for League of Legends, we are in game number two. So that's why we've been long or live so long today. We're pushing five hours here, so lots of esports action. But for now, I'm going to toss it into a BR back screen. Have you guys listen to some music as we wait for game number two to start up. Alrighty, here we go. Loading in to game number two. 
Oh, that's a really cool skin. It's kind of saucy. Alrighty. So, game number two. We're gonna put all this stuff up. Hold the scoreboard. I don't want that. I don't want that. 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 It's gonna go dark here for a second. I'm sorry. Please don't hurt me. We are into it. It's like a very simple five point coming out from both teams. Thirty seconds into minion spawn. Just making sure that no one's invading, no silliness is going on. Lots of pings going on on Vex there. Minions have spawned. So here we go. Is totally bogus. So Lee Sin will be starting on his red buff. Maokai will be starting on blue buff. So both junglers will be going top to bottom. With lots of vision here from MST. They did get that ward over on Lee Sin's Raptor, so they will know exactly where he is and where he is starting. See what Dylan wants to do here. The Eagle's trying to get level two first. Headshot. Tornado will not land for Jana. Level two for the Eagles. Level two for MST in the bot lane. So you are going to see a lot of rocks just being thrown at Camille here in the top lane. Trading here in mid lane. Oh, nice engage there. Good job there from Dylan. Do see Malkai coming down, so they yeah. will back off. A little trade there in the top lane. is trying to get his red. Zeke is here though. Just a missed engage there. Do ignite that Janna. He's not going to go down though. So Zeke is going to take that red buff. Lots of fighting going on over here. Vex is going to flash. Flash from Zeke. And he will get that double kill. He will go down for it though. Oh, Jason needs to be very, very careful. He is probably also going to go down. Eagles now just waiting. Nice engage here. I believe that Caitlyn does have jump though. Oh, nice jump there from Abu. 
Jana will not go down. This one not going well here for the Eagles. Got a little bit too greedy there. MST will pick up a trio of kills. Dragon is coming up right now. Eagles still have Pryo in the bot lane. We'll probably see them go after this. Oh, nice job there from Zeke. He's going to get the kill on the Maokai. Maokai was already still low from clearing his jungle camps. Eagles will go after the first dragon. Oh, Janna might be a little bit too far out. Nice shot there from Zeke. Not quite in range. Abu trying to get it. Does get the heal. He will jump away. We'll take a tower shot, though. We will go ahead and go back to this dragon. Jason's here to help out with the dragon. There it goes. Looks like MST will be starting to potentially look at Rift Herald, but it was already taken. I don't know how it was. I don't think anybody took it. Unless they already took it. Does anybody have it for them? I don't know. Did someone already take Rift Herald? Did I miss someone taking Rift Herald? Or am I just blind? I'm also confused. Looks like we will have a lane swap here by the Eagles. Abu will come into mid with Dylan. Jason will go bot. We'll be taking Rift Herald here. Ooh, Dylan almost got that. Oh, and there's also a Maokai here. That's unideal. Dylan not able to jump away. He will go down. Four to four in the kill department. MST has a little bit more gold though. Oh, 
Alex just doing what Alex does. Hanging out on top. Not too much going on. Playing safe, doing his thing. Not too much really going on around the map. Just kind of people poking at each other. As expected. Jason has come back to mid lane. We're going to see the Eagles go in here. Nice charm there by Dylan. And they will be able to get to Caitlyn. Vex is coming down though. So is the Maokai with the ultimate. Stopwatch from Dylan. Eagles might be able to trade this. Jana ultimate coming in. Abu jumping back into it. will take down another. So a lot of kills coming in all around the map. This dragon is up. It is being taken by MST. Jason needs to be very, very careful here. Oh, he just altered away. Very nice. Rift Herald is summoned here in mid lane. Here comes an engage here by the Eagles. Malachi ultimate. I didn't realize he had it up again. Dylan will go down. able to take down the Vex. Malphite is coming by. Might be able to help out a little bit. Well, Caitlyn Ultimate is going to find its mark. MST will take the advantage up here in kills currently. Dylan is doing what he can in mid. Eagles might look to do another Rift Herald here. Actually, no, it's going to be... Yeah, it's going to be Rift Herald. Oh, Abu's going to find a few people here. So, Abu goes down. Dylan will find... One kill himself. Oh, 
looks like he needs to be careful. He is going to be able to slay Rift Herald. He does pick it up. Will have to flash away. He will get away. Eagles might not want to fight this. Alex needs to be very careful. Ultimate from Caitlyn. Stun coming in from Camille. Ooh, this Caitlyn might be caught out of boo. Is going to get that kill. The Eagles are able to take one down. We do have some help coming in, so we might look to fight a little bit more here come the Eagles never mind Flashes all over the place. MST will come out on the winning side of that one. And Dragon here is up in 30. Patient as a tree. So MST will wait for this. The Eagles, they're going to back. I don't know if we want to just give this dragon. Looks like the eagles will be making their way down towards it. I don't think it's going to be in time though. A nice root there from Dylan. He's going to get the charm. Lots of damage coming in from the Vex though, but it's not going to match. Eagles had their dragon very, very close to being completed. And it will go down. Jason might be in a little bit of trouble here. Jason currently has four people on him. Flash here from the Maokai. Jason working on that Janna, and Janna will go down. Here comes the help. Heal coming out from the Caitlyn. Jeez, he's one shot. Boom might get a little frisky here. Oh, he is not. Meanwhile, Alex farming up this top turret. Here come the Eagles. The Caitlyn is going to get caught out. We saw up top that Vex did try to ultimate on to Malphite, but he just kind of just ran away with his ult. That do be what Malphite do. Eagles are up a little bit of gold, even in the kills. But it looks like MST does have one more dragon than the Eagles do. The Eagles do scale, though. MST somewhat scales, somewhat falls off soon. comes MST. They will be engaging here. Oh, 
Oh, nice root there by Dylan. Good ultimate coming in from the Janna. Abu. He is not going to be able to survive that. Malphite is coming in from the back side. This is what you wanted to see. Nice Malphite R. Ooh, Caitlyn will find that kill. And the Eagles will pick up everybody. We did lose our Tristana as well as our Rise. But a good team fight coming out of the Eagles. Malphite might get caught out. He's gonna flash. Very nicely done. Alex does get out with his life. Did have to burn flash, but no big deal because he has his ultimate coming in. It looks like MST is gonna rush a Baron. MST takes Baron. Looks like we will be able to find one. The Eagles are given chase. Who is going to go down? We're looking for this Tristana here, or this Vex, I'm sorry. Eagles will find a bunch. Only Camille now has Baron buff. Still active on her. We will take that turret and we will say thank you and go to Dragon. So not much going on here. The Eagles just kind of plan what they want to do. As you see, our comp does scale a bit. We are doing a lot of damage. The main focus for MST, they need to make sure that they can get on the Eagles' backline before the Eagles' backline gets too much damage off. Looks like there are four members of MST up in top lane. And Abu is just going to take this inhibitor. This Camille might have gotten a little bit too close. Dylan's going to go in. And Dylan is not going to survive that. <laughs> Eagles got a little bit too excited with seeing that inhibitor. Abu will go in on this Camille. Ultimate from the Camille. Abu does get the heal. 
Nice job there from Abu. There goes the Janna. Eagle's now looking for the Vex. Good kick there. Just gonna miss the Malphite ult. And Zeke is gonna go in on this. And Camille will get the shutdown. The Eagles do have super minions spawning in mid lane. We are also looking at this top turret. Next dragon is up in 2 minutes and 18 seconds. What the heck? Why does it do this? I don't want this. I want this. Thank you. Okay, that red buff just got annihilated. Looks like the Eagles might try to catch out this Vex here. Nice engage here by Dylan. There is... Stopwatch ultimate from Dylan. Naboo's gonna get the kill. Meanwhile in mid we see a lot going on here. Malkai ultimate coming in. Malphite's gonna go ahead and flash out of that. Eagles will take a turret and an inhibitor. Nice route there. Good job here from the Eagles. Malphite or Malkai's gonna try to go back in. Not gonna be able to get out. Eagles are looking for some turrets. They don't have a ton of minions though. That's the issue. Alex might be the only one to get caught out. He will. So Alex will go down. Dragon is up here in three seconds. Oh, that poor Camille. Good ultimate there from Rise. Eagles looking for more. Nice Q there from Zeke. Malkai, the only one left. Malkai ultimate is coming out. And the ace goes to the Eagles. And they might have enough minions to do this. There goes one turret. There goes the other. And the Eagles will win game number two and the match. GG's to MST. Very, very fun game there. The Eagles will win 2-0 tonight. Again, GG's to MST. We wish them the best of luck in the rest of CeeLo. But that is going to do it for us tonight. We have been live for 5 hours and 21 minutes. Thank you everyone for who has stuck around. Thank you everyone who has given us follows. Some subs have come in today. We appreciate all of you. Thank you so, so much. I hope you all have a wonderful weekend. We will be live again tomorrow at 1 o'clock and 2 o'clock. We will have some Overwatch going on. That is for the Blizzard-sponsored league. So we are excited for that one. But that's it going to be it for tonight. Thank you all for being here again. My name is Dan Dew. I'm the Head Esports Coach and Program Director here at Dutchman College. I'm going to be signing us off for tonight. As always, y'all, deuces.